What up, Scobies? What's going on? So the wait, Cadillac. Wait, wait for a few people to, uh, oh, to get yeah, in here. Yeah, yeah, no yeah. Keep it, keep it light. Yeah. Oh, good plan. It's gonna like pair to like Honda. No, you might, yeah, I might get CarPlay to pop up. Oh no, don't CarPlay. CarPlay better work with Periscope. Oh, for safety, this function's not no, available. We won't, we won't enable Cancel. Oh, excellent, cool. No. <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, test drove a Cadillac CT6 with Super Cruise, and. So first we get in and we're like, can I engage it here? Can I engage it here? It doesn't engage anywhere. Um, we are driving, we drive over to Route 1. I engage it on Route 1 and I'm like, eh. Uh, the first- It disengaged around a, around a turn. It disengaged around a turn. And, and it, took a, it took a solid two or three minutes to, to get the system to even recognize that it, it was on a freeway. Yeah. Um, and it was, even when it was engaged, it, was, it didn't feel great. But then, but then we got on the highway. Um, we, we got on the highway, we got on, on 280, big, clear, open. I wouldn't say the quality was a fifth of Honda Sensing. I would say it was like on par with like Honda Sensing um, on like, on like uh, Route 1. But then we got on the highway. But then we got on 280, um, you know, where the bends are pretty shallow and it was flawless. It was, no, Super Cruise doesn't need Comet HD maps. Um, on huge multi-lane highways, it is absolutely flawless. Um, it didn't, so first off, it doesn't wobble. Both autopilot and open pilot wobble in the lane. You don't understand how good it feels when it doesn't wobble. Um, we see it on the gyros too. We, we, we're starting. We'll get, we'll get to that. We'll get to what we're buying in a minute. <laughs> no, guys, but uh, it doesn't wobble. It feels, and this is how people have described it. No, yeah, ping pong. There's no ping pong. It feels like you are on a track. Um, it stays in the dead center of the lane. It did not feel sketchy at all. Um, it did disengage. Oh, bad AC noise. Oh, they don't like the AC noise. Um, yeah, no, no, no ping pong. Yeah, we turned it off. We turned it off. We're good. Um, but why do open pilot and auto? How did GM do it? It's a good question, you guys. Um, we got We got to do away with wobble. We, we got to get serious about beating the evils of wobble. So one way they might have done it is they have maps so they know the exact angle the car is supposed to be at at all times. Uh, they don't have LiDAR. They are using a camera uh, to spot the lanes, a GPS, and a map. Why are we... It's an emergency vehicle. Oh. Behind us? Yep. Damn. <laughs> uh... If you tried a very long turn, you've experienced some minor oscillations. I, I thought it was I thought it was absolutely flawless. Um, on the highway where it was designed. We did get a so there was an exit. There was an exit, and I'm like, you know, you have a problem in open pilot and autopilot where it kind of goes for the exits. Um, it didn't go for the exit, but it disengaged. Uh, it disengaged. Um, it just it, it wobbles the seat, it turns red. Yeah, surprising from GM. Um, I was very happy with, uh, with Super Cruise. I was impressed and uh, it just, you know, we have to do better. It's not wobbling. There's just something that felt so solid about Super Cruise. Yeah, it was very much, even through the curves, it was really dead center in the lanes. Um, yeah, like right here, you see a little bit of yeah, there's a little wobble. A little, little bit of Look wobble. Look at that wobble. Super Cruise doesn't do that. It's um, light, but... So we're driving here on Open Pilot. And the Civic's our best car. Prius wobbles a lot. Um, Super Cruise uses Mobileye. They use Mobileye. Um, they use Mobileye, and then they use... They made a custom HD map of all the highways. So the big downside of Super Cruise is where it will engage. So Open Pilot will engage absolutely anywhere. We just trust the user. 
Um, and then like, there's overshoot on turns too. We could, uh, we can, we can be better. We can, we can be better. Um, you don't have the Prius interface mods. No, 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 no. This is, this is more of a limitation of open pilot. We, we have ideas about how to really just fix well. Their longitudinal control was worse than ours. Um, their longitudinal control, I mean, every, every single system is good on the highway when there's like five mile an hour uh, speed differentials. Um, no, I don't think it's how mobile is doing it. I don't think they're using that. Um, I think they're using uh, just, just the lanes, really. It's detecting lanes from Mobileye, and it's uh, using BHD maps. Yeah, yeah. So I have an idea that once you have a gray panda, by the end of the year, um, if you're on one of the cars that we really try to tune well, I will kill Wobble. I want it to feel as good as Super Cruise. Um, we will generate our HD maps of the lanes, and we'll really just say, okay, you have to stay in the exact center of the car. We have precise localization. We have to just do it. Um, Open Pilot's uh, longitudinal is uh, is better. Um, we came up behind a. St it wasn't a fully stopped car. It was a car that stopped going at about 45, and the braking was way too late. It was maybe, it started breaking maybe a half second before I would have intervened, which is not good. Um, how does camera interpret LiDAR-based maps on Supercruise? So I think they've made very precise maps of where all the lanes are. Um, and then they just use those lane maps. I'm gonna look more into it. I also bought a subscription to the GM service manual this morning. Um, so a few interesting things about Supercruise. It uses a forward radar, it uses four corner radars, and it uses a camera, all connected by flex ray. Um, that Eon fan, I know. Oh, yeah. We should improve the fan closet. It's getting hot, though, I mean. Is it getting hot? I mean, summer's coming. Summer's coming. So. Oh, summer's coming. Oh. You know, these phone, phones are not designed for this, <laughs> but phones with um, a fan are designed for this. <laughs> yeah, phones with a fan are designed for this, yeah. Uh, guys, yeah, you know, we'll, 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 uh, we understand the Eon fan noise is one of the uh, tiny demerits of the Eon. Um, the near gap, it wasn't set on near gap, I couldn't even see. How much did the car I drove cost? Should we show them? The, no, I don't think we should show them the price. I think that's you, can, you can look up the price of a Cadillac CT6. Yeah. I think it's me into the dealership to show the price. Uh, we, yeah. did get, we did get a quote. There's some chance we'll buy it. There's some chance. If, if this weekend I have a absolute, a fit, well, we have to go back to the board, of course. Yeah. Uh, we gotta ask the board. Board approvals key. Board we'll approvals convene. key. We'll convene. We'll have a board late, late on Saturday night. Late, late on, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, you guys are going to see Ready to Ready Player One tonight. I'm excited. Um, you don't care about the fan noise. Yeah, no, we should. I mean, just guys, like everything that's a little bit bad about our products, we should do better and we will do we will. better. That's right. Um, yeah. Next product has a very large fan. Next product has a great fan. Very large. You gotta have large fans. Although, um, is it like asymmetrical fan technology, like the MacBook? You know, the MacBook with the latest MacBooks with Retina display. The fans are like asymmetrical, so that they don't make noise. This yeah. is a huge point in the keynote. I'm not sure if that's patented. <laughs> I think we're just going with the big for fans. <laughs> All right. <laughs> big is the way to go. That works. Um, no, but actually, a lot of the Eon fan noise that we can probably fix with policy. Yeah, certainly. I think the fan policy is a little bit too aggressive. Yeah. Because it's based on the CPU temperature. It's not really based on the heat sink temperature, right? Mm. Um, I mean, we do have a lot of sensors. Yeah. Uh, I'll get that sliding to work. Yeah, the sliding. It'd be cool if that worked. You guys, do you guys like the sliding or do you guys like the tapping to make that appear and disappear? Oh, so, okay, guys. This is more responsive than any automotive you have ever seen. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, uh, oh, oh my god! Oh my god! It's brutal! It's brutal! <laughs> I know. I think we got to do slide and tap if it's easy. Yeah, it's easy. They are mostly voting for tap. Honestly, if you just like slap the screen, <laughs> it's got to work. You got to be in that way. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh I actually, go to the right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Go, no, no, go there, go there, go there. Sorry, there's a car right there. 
there. Yeah. It's all good. We can recover. We can recover. That's true. Uh, you can just go down all the way to that. Yep. Yeah. Um, because, yeah, this isn't how you usually come to work. I don't drive this way. You don't go this way, yeah. Uh, is what on a timer? Oh, yeah, it's on a timer to retract. Is that how we do it? Hmm? Timer to retract? Timer to retract the... Uh, the thing. The, this? Yeah. There's no timer. Well, no, if I just go like that, it'll it does it eventually? Oh, no, we don't have a timer. It's uh, sticky. It's sticky, okay. Yeah. Cool. Um, is full screen mode speed related? Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. Oh, that's I a good idea. Yeah. When you're stopped, we could bring up your applications and, and status. Um, yeah. Expanded at zero? No, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of like, I mean, I like even when I'm stopped, yeah. I think the full screen view is really beautiful. Yeah. So I think I think we'll opt out whatever mode you want to be in. It's just a tap or a swipe away. Well, we'll give you guys a little hint. Not all the screen real estate will stay for the uh, for the camera. We have uh, we have something else we want to do with that screen real Something's estate. Something's gonna be right. Oh my god! Right there. Yeah, right there. Oh, ours is this so good though. Like when, when you look at like, you know, guys, the real reason Cadillac having flex ray. No, I don't want any flex ray shit. That's a, that's a demerit. If it didn't have flex ray, I'd be more likely to buy it. Um. What's the name of that cam? You mean the Kama AI Eon? Uh, that's a Kama AI Eon running the latest open pilot. Tall car, yeah, tall car coming soon. Um, no, what was I gonna say? Uh, honestly, the other reason that I'm, we're probably not gonna buy the Cadillac is there's no OTA updates. That system will never get better. They're never going to add support for the new roads. Maybe a map such as Waze. Well, not Waze. Um, but a map. Oh, that sounds interesting. Let's zoom in there so we can see. Yeah, there we go. I forgot my stabilizer. Scopey's like the stabilizer. The subtle green is nice. It's easy to tell when you're engaged when you're not engaged. No OTA through Monster? No, GM cars don't OTA. Caddy doesn't add to the portfolio the value of the other cars you've added. Yeah, we're not that rich, guys. You all know, if you watch these periscopes, you know we did come into some money recently. But, uh, not enough for a Cadillac and Supercruise. Alright. So, that has been my review. How much? Uh... Let's just say north of eighty thousand um, dollars. The maps can be updated, not the software. So it's possible they could add more roads with a map update, um, but I don't know. I'm not sure how much I would trust that. Open pilot's braking so good. Yeah, much. I, I, it feels much safer feels than much, Super Cruise. Feels much safer than Super Cruise. Our longitudinal is definitely better. Um, but yeah, they're lateral on the highway top-notch so that's been my review of super cruise i'm here with andy hey we are comma ai and this is our eon and you should buy one at shop.com.ai uh there was a comment of sales and saying get you 70k yeah i believe you can get it down to 70 so the car that we were looking at had an infotainment package um it also had uh and that was it i mean i also didn't really negotiate the price um we can always come back the second time and negotiate the price but um, thanks for watching. Email you wear if he is real. Oh, to get a seventy k. I don't know. I don't know. All oh, the oh, sticker on. Don't get me started on stickers on Windows. HDR focus update tonight. Well, I'm gonna see the movie. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Later, comma army.